Can you even believe it? It is Vlogmas Day 1. It's Vlogmas Day 1! I am so stinking excited and so stinking tired. Um, so I probably should be filling you in. If you follow me on Instagram, you know on Monday afternoon I had to fly into New York City for work. Um, I used to do it all the time. All, I don't think there's a Vlogmas that I haven't traveled, but I've never had to go around Vlogmas day one in the lunch. Um, but I flew in Monday afternoon, I flew back Tuesday night, but I didn't go to sleep until 2 a.m. And then I turned around, was at work at 6.20 this morning to make pancakes for my team and have breakfast for them. So I am running on E, but we are not going to let that impact Vlogmas day one. If you're here, you've already seen the intro and you might be thinking, wow, it's really simple and not nearly as elaborate as last year. I was talking to the animators, I couldn't land on a storyline, and I really kept asking myself like, why? Why can't you figure it out? And I realized that Vlogmas 2021 is going to be a lot like my decor this year. Simplicity. There's going to be really big and amazing moments, but I really want the next 20 something days to be about us connecting, building deeper relationships, having an impact in each other's lives. I know you guys look forward to Vlogmas, but I think the gift is truly mine. And I want it to be about so much more than what typical Vlogmases can be about. And with that being said, I, I really thought like, I need the intro to be clean and crisp and simple and beautiful. And that's what I think I accomplished. And that's what I'm hoping to accomplish the next couple of days. I am home from work. People kept telling me to leave and get home and sleep, but it is a little after four. I have one more work call that I have to do at 4.30. But after that, this should be over around 5, 5.15. I have to get that call out of the way. But yeah, this is Vlogmas day one. This isn't exactly how I would anticipate starting Vlogmas, feeling a little bit more tired and maybe not quite myself, and not as cognitively sharp as I often feel. But you know what? We don't miss a day of Vlogmas. In fact, I think over the years I missed one day, and that was because I traveled to New York for work and the hotel's Wi-Fi wasn't strong enough to get my video uploaded and it kept kicking back as an error, but I think the next day I uploaded too. I'm committed to making Vlogmas videos every day. We're gonna do advent calendars today. We'll have some time with Steven. We'll do some chit chatting and we'll talk about the advent of kindness. My merch, the advent of kindness, the Spotify playlist will all be listed down below for you. But this next span of weeks is about us. I got some big surprises along the way, some fun little moments that will happen. One is actually going to be tonight, but you have to watch the video to the end to see what it is. What I ask from all of you is to engage, leave comments, thumbs up the videos, share them with everyone. Let's build our impact, let's have fun, let's allow everyone the opportunity to find our little positive slice of the internet that is so special to us. For all the ones that have been with me, my channel really started out of Vlogmas, and the ones who have been with me all that time and all that journey, thank you. For the ones who are just joining, thank you. I appreciate you, and none of this exists without you. I truly consider you my friends. I talk to many of you in Instagram. It's just an easier way to communicate. I try to answer as many DMs. I read every single one. It's just not possible to always answer them, but I think like we have forged some real, real relationships and it's something I'm really proud of. And I'm proud of all of you that you guys keep it so light and bright and really uplift each other. But that's what we're going to do. We're going to hang out as friends 
and just have a good time. I am excited for some of the surprises I have in store. I'm excited for some of the content I have planned. I've listened to all of your feedback. There will be morning routines. There will be night routines. We're going to talk a little bit about skincare. We're going to do 2022 planners. I'm going to do all the things that we do great here. We're going to have some DIYs. We're going to bake. I'm going to share some family recipes with you. It is going to be a vlogmas spectacular of things that are simple and homey and represent something far beyond just material things that a lot of this can become. So I hope that you join me for the journey. I hope that you are as invested as I am and I hope that we end Vlogmas feeling closer together, more connected, and if anything, that we've taken care of ourselves a little bit more as well as others. A lot of you have noted when you've looked at the advent of kindness this year that it has a lot to do with taking care of yourself. And I think coming out of the last two years, everything is a little bit askew and everything feels a little discombobulated at times. And I think we have learned that we must be taking care of ourselves as much as we take care of everyone else. So I really carved out some moments in the advent of kindness this year that are about you and giving back to you and taking care of you because we cannot give when we have not given to ourselves. And I think we all battle about not putting ourselves first. And my friend, Laura, my best friend, we went, she's the one I spent with uh, time in the Berkshires with a couple weekends ago. She shared a post and it has resonated with me so strongly about like the result of putting herself first. She has been better for herself, for her family, for everything. And I think we just struggle to do that. But hopefully through the work of the Advent calendar this year, you start putting yourself first a little bit. It's going to be a good day. I'm tired, but I am ready to go. And I am excited to be here with you. And let's make it amazing. All right, I'm gonna kind of prep for this last call that I have. I'm gonna guzzle a Coke Zero. No judgment, I know it's not healthy, but it has caffeine, and I've had enough coffee today to keep me awake. I'm gonna have a Coke Zero, I'm gonna get out my work computer, I just need to prep a couple things for this meeting, and then I will catch up with you probably right after, right around five o'clock. So, see you shortly. Oh my goodness gracious. I just wrapped up my meeting. We actually wrapped a little, no, well, like 10 minutes early. It is like four, no, it's 5.16. My meeting was supposed to go to 5.30, so we ended a little early. Steven is not home yet, so I'm glad that's kind of closed out. Talking a little bit about work has like woken me up a little bit because I had to be super aware and present. And Steven texted me while I was in the meeting and he said, um, do you want me to pick up dinner? And I was like, you're the best husband ever. So he is grabbing dinner. Bubby, you didn't say hello and happy Vlogmas Day 1 to everyone. Come here. Tell them. Happy Vlogmas Day 1. It's Vlogmas Day 1. They're going to see you every day. Every day they see you. He's the best pooch. I... Might pour a glass of, actually, you know what? Let's open some advent calendars because I am excited about them. Let's get some lights on. Well, first of all, first of all, first of all, first of all, let me turn this light off so you can actually see. Oh, hold on, let me turn off this one. I want you to actually see, look at the Beekman calendar and the rituals. How cute are those? All right, let me turn on the light so we can open some advent calendars and see what day one holds for us. Beekman 1802 is a... Oh, this is also a snap. Beekman 18, like look how pretty that is. It's a 24 day. This is a 24 day. And then this is only 12, so we won't be opening this for a while. But William Morris is a 24 day one as well. All right, let's start with William Morris. I'm gonna have to put you down. 
look how beautiful this is. I'm super excited about this William Morris one. Like I said, I learned about William Morris. I found like a lot of hotels that we had stayed in in Europe used William Morris toiletries. This is called Strawberry Thief Hand Cream. I'm going to put some on. We all know our hands are dry. It doesn't smell like strawberries. It's super floral, but that is a nice lotion. I also gifted one of these to my best friend, Laura. She has one. I gave it to her when we were in the Berkshires. All right, we need to find day one, which is right here in our village. So then the little house opens up. Do you open the, oh, right here. Day one is a candle and it's so sweet. It's the sweet jasmine candle. Oh, that smells beautiful. And then when you close your house back up and nothing is in it, it lights up even more. Then let's go over to day one of Beekman. Oh, this is interesting. They did them in order. So like the hunt of trying to find it is not as fun. What did we get here? We got the pure goat milk cuticle cream. I actually could use that. All right, I'm gonna, and then like seeing this, like their packaging is just stellar. Um, let's go over to this one. This is the one, these are the ones that we get most excited about. So this is the Mary Mary dog calendar. Each dog is named, I cannot wait. So this dog, is Bailey. That's not Bubba's. I know it's Bailey. <gasps> oh, look at Bailey. Look at Bailey. Bubba's, come meet Bailey. Say hello. This is Bailey. <gasps> Does she taste good? Who is it? it Bailey? Hey, looky. Hey, it's Bailey. I'm all done. All right, we're gonna put Bailey right here. Let's go into the pantry and open our next one. We have Dolly Parton, and we also have the one, the only Sugar Fina. Get ready for it, our yearly tradition. Pour some sugar on me. Wait. Sugar Fina's in order too. Was it in order last year? I like how they did the little tabs. Also, they didn't put the descriptions on the packages. Or maybe they didn't last year. I just can't remember. I think you did have to read. I think you did have to read the um back. So this is the dark chocolate sea salt caramels. These are so, 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 so good. All right, Dolly. Have a holly, Dolly, Chris. Oh wait, we got two songs now. We have Pour Some Sugar On Me and Have a Holly, Dolly, Christmas. All right, day one is right here. And it's going to be a gold chocolate star. I'm super excited, but I will not eat these until we have dinner. So. Those will be there. And no chocolate for doggies. No chocolate for doggies. It's not good for you. You can't have any. No, you cannot. No, you cannot. But daddy will never, well, he will know. Do you know what this is? Should we open it before daddy comes? What is it? Is it yours? Is it yours? Oh my goodness, yes, it's yours. Can you find day one? What is it? What is it? What is it? Is this yours? Remember, we do not tear. What is it? What is it? What is it? You were so excited. <gasps> Looky. <gasps> Go enjoy. Happy Vlogmas. I'm out of here. I got what I wanted. So, when Steven gets home, we will do Chad's tea. 
Um, Stephen often forgets it's called David's Tea, so I think he like called it like every other name in the book. So we will do his advent calendar, um, have dinner, and yeah. I mean, energy is high for just a handful of hours of sleep. But feeling good, feeling good, feeling good. All right, I'll see you shortly. Tell everyone happy Vlogmas Day happy 1. Happy Vlogmas Day 1. I'm so excited. <laughs> he actually isn't. He like walked in while I was editing and he's like, oh, we both had like long days. So, um, we'll do- Look at the, look how pretty uh, it is it this is, year. Yeah, it is. It's, yeah, it has- It has cutouts. It has cutouts. Like, uh, uh, Like my button. tube tops. Babas, you don't wear cutout tube tops in the winter for Vlogmas. Oh, he might make an exception. He has his brave collar. All right, it is. I feel like we're gonna have to clarify his rave collar. Well, I'll, I'll, we'll show it afterwards. Uh, it, it's something to look forward to in the vlogs. <laughs> um, Merry Mistletoe. I think you have to read the back. Well, what does it taste like? I did read the back. No, no, no. Oh. It, it tells you. Merry Mistletoe. Even. So small. Hi, this is what happens when you're old. Apple pieces, raisins, hibiscus blossoms, natural flavoring, cranberries, cloves, apple slices, cinnamon sticks, mistletoe, white tea, rose petals, cranberry pieces, and stevia extract. That's a lot of. <laughs> That's quite a mixture. You love raisins. I do, but I don't know if I like them in my tea. I'll have it tomorrow. I think I'm going to work from home. It's just been a bad day, so. Working. Cause you had a bad day, you take a one down, you drink some tea with raisins and you turn it around. Working working with Bubba's makes my mood better, so. Especially when I wear my tube top with cutouts. Easy. Bubba's, it's not casual Friday. I know, it's Thursday. It's Wednesday. No, tomorrow will be Thursday. Oh. Um, we just had a pizza deliver. I appreciate the no, festive. I delivered. I, I mean, not delivered, picked up, but I appreciate the festive, joyous pizza box. Well, he is going to settle in before we eat dinner. Today's Advent of Kindness is write yourself a note about what you hope to get out of this season. I have my notebook here along with my devotional. I am going to just do that tomorrow and combine my two days because um, I didn't do it this morning because I didn't do my normal routine for the morning. You'll see that tomorrow simply because I went to bed at 2 a.m. and I knew I had such a short window of time to sleep. So tomorrow, I'm going to do day one and day two on the Advent Kind calendar and also do both days of my devotional. On the topics of books, though, I was at the airport once again on Instagram. You would have seen this. And I bought Atlas of the Heart by Brene Brown. It released in the airport bookstore. JFK had it. So I bought it. And uh, the intro is quite long, but I read the intro. It is the most beautifully written intro to a book I've ever read. I resonate with so much of it already. I highly, highly recommend it. I believe I um, am leaving it linked down below in the book section. I'm going to just kind of build out the links because things will overlap and you can always just revisit them from any video and things will be linked and I'm trying to categorize them for you from decor or things you see or things that I might not mention but I know you've seen and kind of want to look at. Get so many comments and questions about these glasses. These glasses can't be bought anywhere, I don't think, anymore. These are actually Celine sunglasses, as well as the lighter ones that you guys comment on a lot, and I had my prescription put in them. You have to be careful with that, because some sunglasses, the groove isn't deep enough to house a prescription lens. Celine, this style worked. I don't know if she still makes this style of sunglasses, but that is the story behind these that so many of you ask about. So we've done David's tea. We know what the advent calendar was. I'm gonna do mine tomorrow and combine my two days. And my little surprise for you, if you wanna join, and I'm gonna try to get this live as soon as possible, but also share it over on Instagram, is at 10 p.m. tonight Eastern, there's a Kelly Clarkson Christmas special. And I thought we would live it together on Instagram and watch it together. If you wanna join, join me over there. But this is Vlogmas Day 1. Not what I anticipated, but pretty darn happy that we got it done knowing all of the circumstances that surrounded it. 
I am super excited. I have so much to share with you and we are going to make this the best Vlogmas ever. So I'm gonna end it like I end all of them. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. Kindness is free, give it to everyone. Until next time, which will be tomorrow. Bye-bye.